take him off here. Johnny, a uh, nil nil draw here today against Colburnie Leeds side, but firstly a two 0 victory on Tuesday against Stirling. Yeah. How did you feel that game went? Um, if I'm being brutally honest, Dougie, the first half wasn't as good as we we expect for the players that we've got in that dressing room. But um, second half we were. We were back at it and we, uh, where we should be with the level of performance that we, we expect for each other. Um, so first half, although we weren't under any any great pressure, I just felt as if we didn't quite get in our rhythm, we didn't move the ball quick enough and we didn't get the defence up high enough up the park. So made a few adjustments at half time and I thought second half totally controlled the game and it was quite a comfortable 2-0 win in the end and uh, fair play to the boys, I think they managed the, the game well and they got the minutes in the, in the tank that pre-season's for and obviously showed wee bits of quality as well, great finish for Forbesy. Um, for the first goal and obviously the, the, the second goal as well just to kill the game with somebody it was a, a great run and finish as well so nah, good to get your striker a goal as well so nah, Tuesday was a really positive night for us and you said you mentioned that first half as a contrast to that today's performance it was 0-0 but a good team performance all around great team performance today do you know what I, I look at second half on Tuesday I think we, we we took up where we left off on Tuesday I think that you can pretty much say for 70 minutes Total control of the game in regards to territory and possession. Maybe no the cutting edge that Colburnie had. They had a couple of chances that uh, Tams made some terrific saves. But I think the way we, we controlled the, the game and, and kind of hemmed him in at times, uh, we just need to work on that cutting edge. But that's that's about forming relationships during training. And the more games we play, the better we'll get. But I thought the signs today for second clean sheet in a week. Do you know? Um, Relationships forming within the team, a uh, couple of new signings coming in that are big characters for us that I felt at times we maybe lacked last season. So, like Jordan and Wayno, their voices in the dressing room, their voices in the park, so that's added something. We Wayne Sproul getting 45 minutes on Tuesday, 90 minutes a day. I thought the wee man's been terrific. Uh, Tam, we've touched on Tam, I thought Tam was excellent today. There's, there's just so many positives, you know, and we've got a week to go to the season, but nah, I'm, I'm absolutely over the moon with the players. When you touched on Tam, was his penalty save late on today just summed up his performance, they won the score in the day? Uh, he just just nailed it for me. I, I actually said to the dugout, I said, Tam will save it. The, the, the game that he had today was, was terrific, and it, what it does is it gives... I had the confidence in him anyway. Um, I'm sure the players did, but it gives him that wee bit added confidence that, do you know, he's got to be the number one this season, as it stands. And do you know, he's kind of went out there and he said, look, I'm, I'm not letting anybody do it and I'm taking this number one jersey. And for me, I'm absolutely delighted for him because he has worked extremely hard. He was patient last season behind Kyle um, and he, he truly showed his quality today. So it's a, it's a big time for Tam for him to step up to the plate. And, if he, his performance is kind of go by today's performance will be will be in safe hands. Aye, uh, you mentioned we're a week away for the start of the season, but firstly we play Trent on Tuesday night in our final pre-season game. Aye. Given that you only had 12 a day, will be a few changes. So. Yeah, well, we'll, ju we'll just need to see what we've got. I think we've got six players coming back on on um, on Tuesday. We'll just need to see how boys recover. Obviously, asking ten of the ten of the 12 players to go and play 90 minutes a day. Um, which is difficult, do you know, we've been kind of building boys up gradually, but great to see Lewis Barr, vice-captain, back playing 45 minutes, we'll see how he recovers, maybe get more game time on Tuesday, to say Dueno's played 90, he's not played 90 for over a year, so we'll need to see how he recovers, but aye, we'll, we'll assess the squad, another good test, you can see we've had three really quality opposition to play against this pre-season, there's no point in going and trying to beat teams 4-5-0, and five nil. do you know, we're, we're kind of looking at Playing quality opposition, Trenent's that as well, so just need to kind of gear up towards next Saturday and play against Trenent and see how we go. Thank you, John. Cheers, do you? Is that a long? Oh,